Hey Libra, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a reading for your current energy. So let's just jump right in and see what messages we get for you. All right, so we have the Two of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So I feel like there could be a relationship um, at this time that is really important to you. Um, I feel like you could be connecting to somebody that is at a distance or maybe far away right now. Uh, for some reason, I feel like that could be something that is surprisingly um, giving this relationship another dimension. So this is already starting to sound really specific. But for those of you that this resonates already, I feel like you really need to um, kind of listen to almost like the themes or the undertones of what this message is saying. Because I feel like the universe is giving me like the superficial snapshot of what's going on between you and this person, right? And it's like, yes, they're far away. They're kind of at a distance right now. Or maybe they're not speaking as much as they want to but it's kind of like this relationship is still so strong it's still so solid and so confident um in nature and so i feel like you're recognizing or maybe the person that you're connecting to is realizing there's something so much bigger happening here aside from the fact that you're overcoming the distance that you two have between each other right it's like nine of pentacles queen of pentacles um ace of cups sorry eight of cups so that's that walking away feeling it's it's you know distance really i think to me is what's coming through the strongest i feel like some of you are either some of you are walking away from a relationship that didn't serve you and you're feeling confident feeling invigorated by your freedom and your independence and you're kind of like i'm going to search for a relationship that serves me but i'm in no rush or others of you are realizing that distance doesn't matter here. Distance doesn't change anything. I still feel like this is something I can count on. I still feel like this is someone I can trust. I still want to see this um, happen, right? I still want to build something here. And so I feel like whatever it is that you're doing, whether it's, you know, you building this foundation for yourself or for this relationship, I feel like no matter what, there's so much strength here. There's so much kind of like... Um, this desire to invest fully with no hesitation. It's like you just feel like this is going to work um, no matter what the obstacles are, no matter how long it takes for things to get either easier. It's just kind of like you are willing to do whatever it takes. Um, let's go ahead and clarify the Eight of Cups. And some of you could be dealing with an Earth sign, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Uh, we have the Sun at the bottom of the deck, so maybe there's also a Leo involved. But I do think that the Sun really just illustrates that happiness and that feeling of bliss. It's almost like the feeling of, wow, we're finally here. Um, we get to celebrate each other. We get to spend time with each other. All of that hard work, um, it paid off. I feel like you could be seeing this person soon or there's going to be some sort of interest in making that happen as soon as possible it's kind of like um there's this buildup of emotions right and i think that the happiness could be that moment when it finally arrives but it's almost like the journey to that is equally satisfying it's like you are fighting for this person or you're fighting for this you know relationship and it's like just knowing that you are doing something um because you want it so badly it's like almost the journey of falling in love is sometimes you know more enjoyable than just finally getting that person right it's like there's something to say about the value of this uh, process that you're having to go through right we have the four of swords king of swords and the knight of wands so again i think things are moving very quickly or they will begin to move very quickly if right now um you know things have been stagnant or not um really moving at all i feel like the four of swords could be that maybe you needed some time to just figure things out for yourself right maybe there's a reason why there had to be some sort of distance or there's a reason why there had to be some sort of disconnection i feel like now you are in this better place for you um not just you know when it comes to this relationship but like maybe you had to figure something out in your personal life before you could fully commit and this time that you had to just really do that has now made you feel so relieved Right? It's like now you can really present yourself to this relationship and to this person and you're just like, I'm ready to do it. I'm ready to go. Um, I did what I had to do. I'm here because I feel like a relationship is only as valuable or is only as strong as, you know, the people um, willing to be present in it. Right. It's like if you are not present in your relationship, are you really even in a relationship? So I feel like you or whoever you're connecting to, maybe it's both ways because right behind the sun um, is the queen of swords. So this king of swords is matching that queen of swords. And I feel like they are both kind of like, I'm here, I'm ready, I'm present. Let's make this happen. We did what we had to do, but we're going to find a way, right, to, to be happy together. And so uh, behind the 
sun, the queen of wands is also the eight of wands. So there could be, sorry, queen of swords. Um, the eight of wands could represent that fast movement. Again, almost like confirmation that things are going to change in the near future. But also um, there could be some things that you're um, l hearing or um, listening to that maybe remind you of this person so it's kind of like the universe is almost trying to talk back to you right so maybe every song that you hear in the radio it's like there's something that makes you think of them or you know maybe there's something that you're watching on tv and it's kind of like it, it it illustrates right what's going on in your life maybe not but i just feel like you're seeing and hearing um all kinds of like downloads and just things that are making you feel really connected to this uh, place in your life right this person this situation I feel like this relationship is um, one worth fighting for. And I think that both of you are definitely recognizing that and really willing to do whatever it takes, even if either, even if they are far away or if there is something in between you two right now that makes it seem like you're not able to just, you know, move faster. But really love this for you. Hope you take it all in. And if you like this reading and it resonated, please give it a like, please subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.